Guys, what's going on? My name is Louis, and God bless every single one of you. Today is February 20, 2024. Welcome to the Grand Prix News Channel. All right, guys, so we have some urgent information coming out. If you can, please share this video. And it says here, confirm explosion at a shopping center, lockdowns, and evacuation place. This is happening in Tustin, California. Let me show you the video really quick. Ooh. All right. Once again, guys, uh, major lockdown going on. I'm praying everybody's okay. Let's see what's going on in this story here. It says, currently, numerous law enforcement officers, including the bomb squad, on the scene as officials have confirmed that there was an explosion in the Tustin Legacy Shopping Center or near the Bank of America in Tustin, California. Evacuation and lockdown are in place and the FB, you know who, is involved. As the loud boom could be heard from miles away, it is not immediately known if anyone hurt this is a developing story. All right, guys, before I start, give this video a big thumbs up. Share this video with your friends, family, some loved ones. I appreciate the love and support. And for those of you that want to contribute to the channel, once again, the PayPal link and the Patreon link is in the description box. Also, guys, $1 a month Patreon. We get your access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about on the platform. Also, I posted videos today. Those link will be in the comments box. And for those of you that want to send us letters to prayer requests, you can send it to me, Luis Santiago, at 3432 U.S. Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34691. All right, so I do have the breaking news article here. We're going to see what's going on here. Uh, Tustin explosion blast sparks evacuation after pipe bomb found near Bank of America. Guys, uh... This is what I've been talking about. The uh, you had the uh, FB. You know what? Uh, I'm not gonna say the full letter, but I did post a video yesterday about uh, warnings and all these events that's gonna happen across the country, and uh, including cyber. All right. So again, uh, please share the video. Let's see what's going on in this one. A terrifying explosion rocked a shopping mall in Orange County, California, early Tuesday morning morning wow as the authority raced to figure out what happened and investigate the scene it says here an explosion rock shopping mall in orange county california in the early afternoon on tuesday as the authorities raced to figure out what happened the blast allegedly occurred at around 1 15 p.m local time at the village at tustin legacy shopping center located in tustin california a municipality just to the south of Los Angeles. Give me a second here, guys. So you have the three letters. The FB blank was quick to arrive on the scene. Along with the bomb squad. And they locked down the area. Evacuated the buildings. Local station KTLA5 uh, reported. The station reported that the explosion occurred near a Bank of America. Uh, you know why <laughs> they went there? Because you got Bank of America there. And this, you best believe this bank is filled with a lot, even gold. And so uh, whenever, you know, if it was like a McDonald's or if it was like something else, it won't be out there. But since it's right next to a bank, uh -uh, we're going there. There's like a uh, $100 million worth of, uh, I mean, money in there, possibly. Actually, I don't think it's $100 million, but you guys get the picture. All right, so once again, the station reported that the explosion occurred near a Bank of America located uh Kensington Park Drive. The result of an illegal firework similar to a mortar that reportedly produced a boom loud enough to be heard from miles away. 
Um, my my guess is that it might have been um again possibly illegal firework. One person was reportedly taken into custody, but further information on that individual has not yet been released. It is also unknown whether anyone was uh, injured in the blast. Though KTLA 5 reported that it appeared that nobody was. Some reports indicate that it came from a pipe bomb. Um, There's a possibility someone just was messing around and kind of created a big boom. Witnesses from the scene took to social media to report that the terror, uh, I'm just going to spell it, T-E-R-R-O-R, -R -R, that played out that fateful Tuesday afternoon at the shopping center, which is located on Endiger uh, Avenue near the 5 Freeway and Highway 261. I'm not going to play this video because I already played it at the very beginning. Uh, it says here, Tustin Police, OC Bomb Squad, and OF, excuse me, OCFA have all responded to shopping center across from Burn Down Hangar. Part of shopping center has been evacuated after reports of a possible explosion. Hmm. What in the world was that? Question mark. It sounded like a giant explosion. I went outside on the balcony to look. Expected to see mushroom cloud. Mushroom cloud. Terrified residents. Uh, I'm going to skip the person's name. Wrote on Facebook. I'm in Tustin. Just in crime scene at uh, Kensington and Columbus Avenue. Taped off firefighters and police cars in there. Apparently, there is a pipe bomb in Bank of America. Police are trying to detonate it. What? Give me a second here. I, I want to refresh this uh, Twitter page here really quick. Oh, does he have an update? I'm sorry, guys. There was an update here. Officials say the explosion caused by a homemade illegal mortar-like firework that was set off near one of the entrances to the shopping center produced a loud boom that could be heard from miles away. According to multiple reports, one person was taken into custody. <sighs> Unbelievable. Wow. Give me a second here. Unbelievable. Ah. Oh. Okay, I want to bring this up. I want to bring this one up. So you have one arrest after setting off mortar type firework near Southern California. Once again, uh, <clears throat> one person was cuffed Tuesday after they allegedly set off a mortar type firework near Southern California shopping center. Reports of an explosion at the village at Tustin Legacy. We already know that. Evacuation. We already know that. Uh, there were no injuries and there was no damage to the mall. There was no damage. I mean, that was a big boom. I mean, uh, again, that's a good thing. No damage. Nobody's hurt. But, uh, yeah, um, that person, uh, yeah, he's going to have uh, he's. Possib <clears throat> possibly going to have to be, uh, pay a huge fine, uh, do some time, and uh, he's going to have a huge record on his uh, his list. So the Tustin Police Department said one person was taken into cuffed, uh, custody. 
but did not provide further details such as exactly where the sus suspect lit the firework. So the Orange County Fire Authority said it responded to a suspicious package. Now you have the three letter, the FB, you know what, Los Angeles field office also responded, which it does as a matter of routine for reported explosion. There's been multiple explosions, like house exploding and stuff like that, but you don't see the three letters going to that one. But uh, when it comes to this one here, guys, it just because it's right next to a bank. I mean, that's what I believe. And um, I mean, gas line, pipeline explosion and all that houses being, you know, boom. I mean, you don't see the three letters out there. It's all firefighters and, uh, you know, law enforcement. All right. So once again, guys, the shopping center includes restaurants, salons and gyms. Tustin is more than 30 miles as 48.28 kilometers southeast of downtown Los Angeles. All right, so this is the breaking news, guys. So I do believe that the lockdown has been lifted. The mall is closed. They're going to close that mall down till tomorrow. Um, but uh, yeah, this is where we are right now, guys. They really, uh, again... It's very sad that uh, the person that did this, uh, I don't know what was, I mean, he might have been young, who knows, but uh, yeah, he's going to be in big trouble for this one. You have uh, multiple agency there, firefighters, police, and the FB, you know, and bomb squad. Yeah. You're going to be sitting down and they're going to be talking to you. <sighs> Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, again, any updates, I will make sure I post on Twitter. Follow me on Twitter if you guys want all the latest information. The links will be in the comments box. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Once again, for those of you that want to give a like to Christ, you can email me. My email is in the description box. Me and my wife are here to help many and to lead many to the righteous path. And that's the path of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. For those of you that want to send us letters or prayer requests, you can send it to me, Luis Santiago, or my wife, Jessica Santiago, at 3432 U.S. Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34691. Once again, guys, $1 a month Patreon. We get your access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about on the platform. Also, I posted videos today. Those links will be in the comments box. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you all. Put your faith and trust in Jesus Christ, for he's the only way the truth, and the life. No one gets to the Father but through Jesus. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time later. Peace.